These are restaurants you should try if you're ever in Detroit, Michigan. If you're looking for breakfast, Iggy Eggies is the place you need to go. I think it's in downtown Detroit, if I'm not mistaken. Don't quote me on that. This place is very unique when it comes to breakfast sandwiches. I had a hash brown sandwich, I had an onion roll sandwich, and I had a pancake sandwich. All three of the sandwiches were literally to die for. It's very hard to find good breakfast in Detroit, if you ask me, my own opinion, but this place got it going on. So if you're in Detroit and look for breakfast, check this place out. If you are looking for desserts and you love pies, Sister Pies is where you need to be at. These pies are so, so f***ing good. I had a milk chocolate pie, I had a scone, I had a beets pie, which was not good because I don't like beets, but if you love beets, you'll like it. And I also had a salted maple pie. All the pies were amazing. So if you like pies and you're in Detroit, check this place out. If you like peppers, stuffed peppers, go to Detroit Pepper Company, please. Just, just take your ass over there and get some good peppers, man. The person that owns this restaurant does a phenomenal job when it comes to stuffing the peppers. You understand what I'm saying? I'm talking rice, sauce, cheese, beans, whatever you want in a pepper, they got you. He also had an amazing, an amazing black bean burger that I just love. This place is definitely a hidden gem in Detroit, so if you like peppers, check this place out. If you're looking for a breadless concept, breadless in Detroit got your bike. They got these collard greens, right? And they stuff the collard greens with just a bunch of freaking toppings, man, that you are going to freaking love. They also have Swiss chard too, so if you like Swiss chard, you'll love that. My favorite personally was the balsamic mushroom. It's gonna tap that ass, I'm telling you right now. So if you're in Detroit and you love a good brothers concept, check this place out. If you love pickles, you are going to love what's the deal, point blank period, in a discussion. They got these pickles, these beautiful pickles, and they stuff them with all types, all types of stuff. Lettuce, tomato, bacon, peppers, crab meat, anything you can name, they got you. And they also have some other breadless items that I did not know about either. But if you love pickles, this place is a place you do not want to miss out on. If you love a good taco, if you love Mexican food, Taco El Caballo is the place you wanna be. I think it's called Caballo or Caballo. The tacos, the torta, the burrito here was just flat out amazing. This place has some of the best Mexican food I've ever had in my life, and I've had some good Mexican food. The Mexican food here is as close as you're going to get to authentic Mexican food from Mexico. So if you like Mexican food, you need to come and try this place out immediately. If you've never had a video pizza before, right across the street is a place called Tacos El Gordo in Detroit, Michigan. And I'm going to tell you right now, the video pizza was just chef's kiss. I had a ceviche tostada too that was just off the charts. That was good as well. That video pizza was just on the money. It wasn't as big as I'm used to having it, but when it comes to the filling, what's inside, the cheese, the meat, <laughs> it's definitely up there when it comes to video pizzas that I've had across the world. So if you love Mexican food, if you love video pizzas, this is a place you need to check out. If you're looking for a good Detroit style pizza, Michigan and Trumbull is the place you want to be. This place probably is the most underrated pizza joint when it comes to Detroit style pizzas. I had a, a, a pepperoni pizza that was amazing. I had a pizza with arugula that was just phenomenal. And the one that stood out the most was the pizza with lemon zest. And if you get this pizza, you might want to get extra lemon zest. The lemon zest takes the pizza to a Oh, another level. I'm telling you right now, this place is somewhere you want to be if you love Detroit style pizza. They do a lot for the community. They're really nice people. This is a complete sleeper and you need to check this place out. If you're looking for a good burger, some good fish, food exchange, got your bike. So I had this thing called, I think it was called the Big Baby if I'm not mistaken. It had corned beef and a beef patty on there. The potatoes I had with the shrimp, Everything was seasoned, flavorful, amazing. The fish that I had there, amazing. I'm not sure if a lot of people don't know about this place, but this place is definitely one of those spots to where if you know, you know, you feel what I'm saying? So if you're in Detroit, be sure to check this place out. If you like kimchi, if you like wings, if you like just good food, man, Super Crisp is where you need to be at. Located on the campus of Wayne State, if I'm not mistaken, when it comes to kimchi, this place creates some very creative, flavorful dishes. I'm telling you that right now, but aside from the kimchi, comes to wings, bruh. These wings at Super Crisp is gonna blow them socks off. 
If you're a person that likes a little spicy in life, you'll most definitely love this place. So if you're in Detroit, please, you've got to, I mean, you've got to check this place out. And last but not least, if you're looking for a good waffle concept, Waffle Cafe got your bite. I love a good waffle. This place blew my mind. Concept, the creativity, the waffles, amazing. So if you're a waffle guy like myself, I'm telling you right now, these are some of the best waffles, if not the best waffle concept that I've ever came across on this channel. If you love waffles, if you're in Detroit, check this place out. That's it. I love y'all. Thank y'all for changing my life.